For your last step, you're going to flip the cushion right side out. So using your fingers in that opening, turn it. And then using a pointer, put it through the opening and poke out those four corners so that they look like a 90 degree angle. So once your cushion looks good on the outside, you're ready to stuff it. So using the scale, you'll turn it on, put a bag on top, and put stuffing in inside the bag until it weighs between 230 to 250 grams, and then you're going to fill a, the opening of your cushion. And it may look somewhat uneven at the beginning. You may need to sit on it or move it around a bit to even out the stuffing, and then you'll hand sew it shut. Now that I've stuffed the cushion fully, I'm going to take a yellow pin and just pin that opening shut, and then take a hand sewing needle, cut it, wet it, thread it through that hole, going front to back, have it doubled, so pull that thread till it's down past my elbow, cut those threads where they meet, put the threads behind the tip of the needle, trying to even them out, and then wrap the thread around the tip of the needle about four or five times, pull the threads directly down to the bottom, and I should have a knot, a substantial knot, which I'll hide inside the edge of the cushion. Using that needle, now I'll take a little of fabric on the top of one side, go directly across to the other side, pull it tight, go down about a half a centimeter, do the same thing, and I'm just taking a little bit from the top of either side, going directly across, pulling tight, and notice I'm using a matching color thread so that my stitches are not visible. I'll continue all the way till I get to the end and then knot it and your cushion will be finished.